Seahorse Care Rescue Centre. And we thought an update on Pee Wee would be a very good thing to do today. So, here he is. Here's the little guy. He's doing very, very well. He's peeing, <laughs> which is very important. Um, the surgery that he had is here. It's a little bit gunky at the moment because I have to clean it twice a day. The urethra came from his bladder and it comes directly out of a hole that they've made here. So basically he pees like a girl. He still has his penis and everything. Now, everything else is still there, but obviously he can't use it. So now when he pees, it all comes out of his back end. So fingers crossed, providing the hole doesn't close, which it shouldn't, and also that he doesn't get any more um, growth in the, um, the, the tube that's left, um, he should be okay. So really, I think he was very aptly named Pee Wee, because uh, we actually named him that, because when we rescued him, this little guy, had a huge problem that, he, that blood was pumping out of his penis and he had to be rushed off to the hospital as soon as we got him. He also had to have a CAT scan because he had a huge lump above one of his eyes. So um, over the years that we've had this little guy, he has actually made many trips to the hospital. Now he was actually abandoned and tied to railings in Lorca next to the university and for two weeks the students and people were giving him food. Nobody would take this little guy and in desperation the council in Lorca actually contacted us and we agreed to take him. So um, he's been with us now for quite a few years. I can't remember how many years. We absolutely love this little guy. He's a lovely, lovely little pony. So, as I said, he was very aptly named Pee Wee, and um, 